What's up gamers, it's weekly release highlight time here at Desura, so sit back, relax, and let us show you what we've got on tap for this week's selection of game releases. Remember Forever in Wales Interactive's October 29th release of Master Reboot. Enter a world where all of your deepest memories unfurl for your own enjoyment in the constant digital throb of the soul cloud. A harrowing journey through haunting rehashes of old memories, Master Reboot can be purchased for $13.49 on the Windows operating system. You would think that intrepid travelers would stop showing up at creepy cabins and foul occult forests, but it's sort of like trying to keep Sean Bean from getting killed mid-movie. You just can't stop it from happening. Knock Knock is the name of the admittedly creepy game and Ice Pick Lodge's newest feature in which players must maintain their homes under the impending onslaught of the supernatural. Available for $9.99 for the Mac, Windows, and Linux operating systems on November 4th, get ready to Knock Knock and hope that no one answers. Creepers are everywhere in the age of the internet, and apparently they found their way to the surface in Knuckle Cracker's November 9th release of Creeper World 3 Arc Eternal. Build, bomb, blow up, and otherwise nom on the tremendous strategy offerings while keeping the creeping to a minimum. Available for purchase November 9th for the Windows and Mac operating system, creep on in and grab a copy for $14.99. Featuring wads of weapons, stacks of spells, and a two-player couch co-op mode for the friendship yoked, Almka releases on November 4th for $2.70. Enter a well with witchery on its mind and fight your way through the mob-filled fray in an attempt to defeat your own self-conscious. Drawing from titles such as The Binding of Isaac and Nuclear Throne, Dev6 Game Studios has laid out the welcome wagon, so get in and grab on. Almka is compatible with the Windows and Mac operating systems. Fleets under my control always seem to get busted, and as a testament to that fact, or so I like to tell myself, Casual Logic has created a game which already declares the fleet busted long before it gets to my sweaty little palms. For those with a tower defense itch, Fleet Buster offers you direct control over your defenses as you hold off the invading hordes. Available on November 6th for the Windows operating system, Fleet Buster can be purchased for $4.99. Being the old man that I am, I remember a time when solitaire existed outside of phone space and neighborhood nerds parties were an excuse to stay up until 2 and 3 a.m. That being the case, I continue to have no small obsession with card games and Lotus Games Didgery has arrived to inflate the psychological issue. Move cards around the grid by value or by suit to score points and move towards victory in multiple game modes which each drastically change the flow of play. Didgery is available for purchase on November 7th for $2.50 on the Windows operating system. Square off against a crazy camera for platforming fun and a bit of vertigo in Gent Dev's new art platformer, Malevich. The goal is simple, climb as high as you possibly can, but as with many gaming endeavors, it is more difficult than it appears. The game is great for fast play or developing a new obsession, and can be purchased on November 7th for $1.99 for the Windows operating system. Take a tank trip and slip down memory lane with Dickie's new thunderous title, Small Tanks. Take control of your tiny titan and attempt to tread heavily on your foes while keeping yourself in one piece. Inspired by the Atari games of yesteryear such as Battle Tanks and Combat, lob shells and give them hell in this no holds barred old school shooter. Small Tanks is available for the entry fee of $2.99 and is available for Windows and Linux platforms on November 3rd. For those among you who missed the old days of simple platforming and the delightful chirp of 8-bit consoles, Retro Garbage launches its alpha funding on November 4th. With a price point set at $2.99, you can help the developer, Sloth Soft Games, get this show on the road and support the game from the ground up. Featuring a 1980s vibe and gameplay to match, go against what your parents told you and dig through the Retro Garbage. Just sort of watch out for needles and, you know, MRSA. Modern medicine is a wondrous thing, and as its most recent benefactor, you now have the privilege of learning to use an ornery new robot hand. Take control of an unruly robo-prosthetic as you attempt to lend your cantankerous coot of a father a hand at making tea in Projector Games' Amputee. Chasing on the heels of Surgeon Simulator and other anti-games, Amputee promises rage with every ah, inspiring cup. Amputee is available for the Windows platform on November 3rd for $5.99. Deep Dungeons and their dingy denizens have nothing left to scare you with anymore because Dungeon of Elements has a pill for that. Combining classic dungeon diving gameplay a la Eye of the Beholder with a Dr. Mario meets Modernity mashup, there's something here to enjoy for both RPG gamers and puzzle players alike. Available on November 9th for $19.99, Frog Dice promises pills, paths, and a precocious cast of monsters for the Windows operating system. That's all for today, and it's so sad to say, but we here at Desir will have a fresh frame of new games for you next week. Thanks for stopping by this week's episode of Release Highlights, and take care, everybody.